Hi everyone, welcome back to the React.js tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about DOM events. All React events are written in camel case and uh, React event handlers are written inside curly braces. Let's see how we can use DOM event. So go to the project and inside the project, just click on src then components and now click on open post component inside the post component uh, just add here button so just create a button so just write here button and inside the button just print a message click here okay now inside the button just add here on click event so just write here on click is equal to the bracket okay inside the curly bracket add the click handler method so first create click handler method here so just write here handle click and inside this method just pass here the argument e all right inside this handle uh, click handle method just print the state okay so just write here console.log and inside the console.log just write here this dot state okay now add this handle click method inside the on click event so just write here this dot handle click okay now save the file and let's see the result so go to the browser and go to the url localhost 3000 and here you can see here the button now make visible the console so for that just right click and click on inspect element and just click on console tab all right now console tab is visible now click on this button so just press and you can see here state element okay is name and skills okay you can see here inside the state name age and skills okay all right now see the on mouse over event so for that switch to the project and create another button so just write here button inside the button just type here a message like mouse over here all right and inside the button just add here on mouse over event okay is equal to it. now create a function for handling the mouse over event so here just create a function handle mouse over okay is equal to pass here the parameter e arrow function and inside this handle mouse over event just write here console dot log just print the e dot target comma e dot page x okay now add this uh, handle mouse over event inside the on mouse over event so just write here this dot handle mouse over event okay handle mouse over now save the file and switch to the browser and you can see here mouse over here button okay just mouse over on this button and you can see here if i hover this button you can see here the page x position and your target okay and means button 
all right now let's see the on copy event so switch to the project and here just create a paragraph so just write here p tag and in this paragraph tag just write here this is a test paragraph right and in this p tag just uh, add here the on copy event so just write here on copy is equal to curly bracket okay now create method for handle the copy event so just write here and copy is equal to inside this just pass here the e fat arrow then a curly bracket start and close okay inside this function just write here console dot log and simply print the message para paragraph has been copied okay now add this event inside the on copy uh, add this method on cop on copy event so just write here this dot handle copy okay now save the file and let's check so, so switch to the browser and you can see here the paragraph let's try to copy this so first of all select this and just copy and you can see here the event paragraph has been copied okay so in this way you can use dom event in react so that's all about dom events so thanks for watching this video and if you still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching